Yeah, more breaking news tonight. A Gwinnett County mother and father back in custody following nearly two months on the run, accused of keeping their kids locked away inside of a home for months. The accusations only came to light after their son allegedly set the house on fire, killing his 10 year old sister. Tracy E. McBeard joins us live at the Gwinnett County Jail. Tracy, how did law enforcement finally track the parents down? Well, the sheriff's office fugitive unit arrested both William and Karina McHugh after spotting their car near the Appalachian Trail. Now they were taken into custody about 50 miles north of here in White County, Georgia. They were wanted for charges of child cruelty and false imprisonment. Investigators started looking into the couple after their home caught fire on April 17th and their 10 year old daughter Zoe was killed. Their 15 year old brother was arrested for murder for allegedly starting that fire on purpose. Police say while investigating further, they discovered the parents had allegedly not allowed their children to leave the home for most of their lives and had deprived them of basic medical care, nutrition and hygiene for years. Now, three siblings were then placed in defects care. The father initially appeared in family court in connection with that, but they both allegedly took off and stopped answering investigators calls. Uh, we just do know that they were apprehended and brought back to the Gwinnett County Police Department for questioning by the Special Victims Unit detectives. Now, the McHughes are both being held without bond, but are expected to go before a judge tomorrow morning at 8.